So at uh, 915 Central, 1015 Eastern, we got number 19 Arizona State traveling to number 23 BYU and one of the most anticipated matchups of the week. I understand probably you could give that award to Florida, Alabama, or Penn State, Auburn, right? Uh, but this is an underrated matchup in my eyes because you got Arizona State, who is one of the three left undefeated teams in the Pac-12, right? So they're all, like a lot of other teams are still playoff eligible, but you only the only ones left are Oregon and UCLA, right? And Oregon and UCLA get all the attention, but Arizona State has been doing some great things offensively too, and uh, they've looked really good so far. But then you got BYU who has flown into the top 25, a team that not many people thought were going was going to be very good this year, the Cougars. Uh, they lost Zach Wilson, but yet they've still attained success. Uh, they were still very good, right? They beat Utah in the Holy War for the first time in a long, long time. Um, so this is a different BYU team as well. So this Arizona State team was I, was a team I thought, uh, I mean, they were a dark horse to make the playoffs, in my opinion. Because the Pac-12 has a lot of teams that are like that, right? Um, so I'm like, ah, which one do I think is better? And then you have... BYU. BYU is a team that was not even on my radar. I'm going to be honest. I was like, I'm thinking of Independence. Like, if I had to listen to Independence, I thought we were going to be good this year. I thought Notre Dame was going to be good. I thought Liberty was going to be really good. Uh, I thought Army had the potential of being good. BYU had kind of slept under my radar, despite them being almost a playoff team last year, right? With Zach Wilson. Now, how much of that was Zach Wilson? And I thought a lot of it was Zach Wilson, plus you lose Dax Milne. Um... There was a good amount to be a little bit hesitant on in the BYU side, but dang, the Cougars just went out and proved them wrong last week when they beat Utah, right? So the Utes were a good team. A lot of people thought they were possible Pac-12 South contenders with Charlie Brewer, and they still are, right? I don't think Utah fans need to get down on themselves quite yet. Utah still can make the playoffs. This is still a possible playoff team. But you look at Arizona State. Arizona State has been playing phenomenal football. So is BYU, um, but I, I just... I love the way Arizona State runs the ball. Their quarterback is a dual threat that is amazing to watch. I just love watching Arizona State play football. And I just I love watching these this Sun Devils team. So give me the Sun Devils to win at BYU, uh, even though they're, they're still favored by 3.5 points. So I like them here on ESPN.